My name is Raj, I'm a CTO of Mimos. Uh, I take care of all the technology development in, in Mimos today. Okay, we started uh, hyper performance computing about uh, five years ago. And then we moved on further looking at something called heterogeneous computing, not just using computing at the CPU level, but looking at computing at the GPU level, what we call GP, GPU. The idea was this is to get lower cost computation, to get better efficiency and also lower energy. I think the technique today has been uh, really in the high performance computing area, uh, especially in the area of oil and gas, uh, in the area of animation. Uh, but we don't see much adoption currently in the area of big data. Uh, we think with the new banking requirements like Bessel III coming out, we think it would be a key thing for the banks or finance institutions to start using uh, high performance company using GPU because it's, uh, it's low in capex and will help them make some of the requirements required for Bessel III which is things like risk assessment and things like that. It's slowly coming about. The local players uh, have not been exposed too much into this technology and purely because they see the gains in terms of dollar and cents. It's, it's purely a big uh, monetary benefit to the companies. They see lower cost of doing high performance computing. Instead of buying lots of CPUs, they're using GPUs for computation. It saves them money. So bottom line is a dollar and cent issue. It's not a technology issue. It's actually a business issue right now. By doing the GPU thing, two things happen. It will reduce the time for computation and more. Number two is a lower cost for them to do computation. But we're going further looking at how to use the data to do things like business intelligence, uh, data analytics using the same thing. So we think that will really push the market forward because today with lots of data from social media, data from uh, blog sites, uh, data from the World Wide Web, uh, it's a key technology required to get the data into something you can understand and get meaning out of it. Okay, we, we recently received uh, the, Gen, the Gen 8 from HP. The interesting part is the new series has got a very fast PCI Express bus. It's called the PCI Express Gen 3. It's got higher speeds. So this helps data movement between the CPU and GPU much faster. Yeah, that's the uh, one of the higher end uh, architecture from, from NVIDIA that enables us to do uh, very high performance uh, computing at a very uh, uh, efficient cost cost model. Yeah, I think the other part we need to be clear about why we use GPUs is not purely just for computation but also energy saving. Becoming almost a fraction of the cost to power up some of the GPUs compared to CPUs. So you got to understand if you're going into real high performance computing, uh, GPU is almost coming to need, not because of the cost of computation, because we don't have enough power to power it up, physical uh, power from the uh, utilities today. So it's very important to have that because the uh, cost of energy is going up, uh, cost of indirectly linked by the biofuels. So I think that's key for us to look at energy saving by using some of these technologies.